Hi everyone, let's take a look at the following integration example. Find the antiderivative of e to the power of pi with respect to x. Step number one, bring the constant e to the power of pi to the front, which means this becomes e to the power of pi times the antiderivative of one with respect to x. When you find the antiderivative of one, that's going to be x, don't forget you're looking for a family of solutions at a constant c. How do we know if we're doing it right? Spend one extra minute. Double check. Double check means if you write down y equal to e to the power of pi times x plus c, and you find the derivative dy by dx, ideally you would get the question back. And in fact, when you do find a derivative of e to the power of pi times x, that's going to be e to the power of pi. When you find a derivative of c, that becomes zero. So as expected, you get e to the power of pi back. I hope this makes sense.